Hi, I'm Grant Burney. I'm the Management Advisor and Coach at Transpower. I look after just over half of the organisation and uh, my job is to lift management's understanding of itself and how we manage people in a very technical organisation. What I've been looking for for a long time was a course about leadership presence. And I've been to the New Zealand Peace College, just trying to work out how a young constable controls a room full of party goers, went to um, uh, acting groups, trying to look for a way that someone could actually take charge of an organisation without having to flash their sheriff's badge. And uh, what Andrew was doing with the horse, showing the horse and demonstrating in terms of uh, the feedback, the energy, the presence, intention, um, quick feedback, um, was just what I've been looking for and it was done in a non-conventional environment it was outside the classroom, it was outside the ordinary things but it was so compelling, so so energising that I just wanted to investigate more of it to see if I could use it in the way that I wanted to for a particular group of managers. I was really really excited about what I saw and uh, the, the brochure was superb, um, the presentation was excellent, and I could see not just what was there in front of me, but what was possible from the course. And uh, the wonderful part is I got engagement about it. This wasn't, uh, I wasn't just going to get what they had on offer and nothing else. We were able to have input into what we wanted out of the course, how we'd run it. We turned up with our own cameras uh, so that we'd have individual recordings for the managers to take away. It's that of all the training we've done in the last four years, it's the most memorable training for any of the people. And you can't just buy that off the shelf in the normal sales process. What we got was an engagement. No, oh, that was uh, that was frighteningly easy. It was um, we weren't dealing with a, a slick oversold operation. This wasn't uh, life insurance. Um, so basically you dealt with people who were interested in what you wanted to achieve by using what they were very, very good at. And, and you got uh, a brilliant mix of the, the storytelling and the ability to put things in context from Janine and, and just the, not just the excellence and, and the ability to deal with horses but to relate and translate what uh, he was doing in a way that would make it relevant and easy for you from Andrew. It, it really worked very, very well. Before we even put people in there, we I sat down with the general managers of these very senior managers in the organisation and uh, told them why um, I was looking to select these particular people to go on the course, asked them what expectations they had of the day and asked them what behaviours they'd be looking for when they came back and we had an agreed set of behaviours we were looking for around leadership presence, around motivation, around feedback, around energy um, and around basically the ability to manage people up to the level they were capable of. And, and both general managers stressed the point when they came back into the office, they told them that they were looking for those things and they could see them. So uh, here we are, we're uh, nearly a year on from the process, we've just done uh, a proof of concept before we're allowed to go into the next round of sending people on there. It's got the highest memory recall of any course we've done for any of the staff that's on. And these are senior managers who attend some pretty fine institutions of learning. Uh, and the lessons are still very clear for them. So an independent co consultant came in. Trish Louie did a wonderful job going through each of them, interviewing them. I wasn't present at any of those interviews. And we got the results that we were looking for. The people still have the lessons because it's memorable. There's nothing like getting direct feedback from an animal four times your size who's not open to being bought a coffee or understands how important you are, you getting the real thing and when it works for you, it's a breakthrough moment. It's not just a point of understanding, it's a breakthrough and it's memorable and because of that it works. We had a number of follow-ups, so of course there's an email you receive from your horse uh, for each of the participants and that's the first thing and it's just a Straight out recall, keeps things top of mind. Um, for myself, I assembled uh, two other coaches uh, and we went in to coach people around what they learned, what the breakthrough moment was, how they can translate that back into the office environment and what they're going to do with it. And of course, because you're coaching, 
it's their solutions and the way they intend to deal with it. Um, and that was powerful. Um, the next stage was there's a, there's a further email later on from your horse. Um, and then there's a series of matters that, that I go around and ask the people. So what are you doing with it? How did this session work? Was there anything that session you could have done differently? Is there anything you would have done from the horse day that we would have done differently? And, and the ability to call on that experience and have the lexicon around those behaviours is again, they were very simple learnings done in a powerful way. I recommend to all those people that aren't too cautious around it. It's not classroom learning, it's not safe. And one of the great things about how powerful it is is that it's not safe. No one comes in there full of confidence that they're going to master all those things on the first day. But by the end of that day, my least fit managers, my least confident managers, have come through and breakthrough moments. And they know that they can do this. They've got direct feedback. They've got real energy around it. They want to go back and do something with it.